At least three people have died after more flooding in the state of Aragua in northern Venezuela. This is the second major flood event in the state this month. Heavy rain on the 17th of October caused flooding in northern areas of Maracay, capital city of Aragua state and areas of Girardo municipality. Mudflows and landslides from the surrounding mountain slopes were also reported. Girardo government officials said El Castaño, Corozal and Palmarito neighborhoods have all been severely affected after the Palmarito Creek broke its banks. The officials confirmed three fatalities and said at least 50 homes have been damaged or destroyed. Roads have been damaged or blocked, impeding access. Nicolas Maduro, president of Venezuela, visited the area on 17 October. At least 50 people died and more are still missing after catastrophic flooding and landslides in the town of Tajerias, Aragua, on 8 October. Over 300 homes were destroyed and hundreds of others damaged. At least three people have been killed in northern Venezuela after another landslide swept away vehicles, trees and huge boulders, destroying everything in its path. The landslide in El Castano, a neighborhood in the town of Maracay, about 80 kilometers west of the capital Caracas, was caused by intense rain and flooding and came about a week after more than 50 people died in a similar incident in a central Venezuelan town. Locals shared videos of trees, big rocks and cars being dragged by the current of mud and water that left more than 50 houses damaged. Responders worked through the night to clear mud and rocks from the road, with lights from vehicles illuminating the works it says the area was left without electricity, 